What's up, y'all? So today we're going to be getting into some of the NYCC Funko Shop exclusive Funko Lottery. Thanks to the big winner, Chief himself. It's my cousin, Jamarcus. Let's go ahead and crack these pops open. We've been waiting long enough, you guys. All right, you guys, like I said, we're going to be getting into some NYCC stuff. Hopefully, there's no mishaps. There was a pop going around that was actually sent in the wrong pop box. It's uh, the wrong pop in the wrong pop box. So that's been going around. And hopefully, there's no damage stuff. I've seen pictures of pops getting damaged from the Funko shop themselves. So without all of that, here's the box. We're about to get into it. Jamarcus won the Funko Lottery and actually doesn't have a YouTube or an Instagram or none of that stuff. So it is possible, you guys, for just common old folk to win the lottery. With that being said, let's get into it. So this is how it was packed. We got a lot of fishy here. And I think overall, I think overall there was a few things got. So I see, hold on, hold on. We gonna do one at a time, Playboy. He's so eager, y'all, to see the Danny family. We're gonna do the first one uh, right here. They got it in bubble wrap. I don't know if you can obviously tell. NYCC sticker. We got the Miles Morales. Uh, what do, what do they call these ones? Like the street art ones? Street yeah, art. street arts. There's they got I think five or other five or six other ones coming out with like Daredevil and something else. So that Daredevil. is the first one. Yeah, yeah, I think that's it's the first that. one that they that. put out. The box looks good. It does have the official con sticker. So I'm actually pretty happy about it. It looks really dope. A lot better in person. Go ahead, and get to the next one. We just gonna uh, randomly reach. Randomly reach, oh baby, the young Ben, young bloody Ben to be exact. That is pretty dope. This is limited to 2,000 pieces, as you can tell right there. This is pretty dope. I like that. Right now, it's selling for about 250 bucks. Yeah, so he's hoping to trade that for uh, Black Lightning. So anybody watching this got a Black Lightning pop, get in touch with me and I can get in touch with him. So Y'all can get a good little trade on some limited pieces. How you feel about what's going on so far? They, they shipping them pretty good. I don't see any problems. This, this was actually the pop that was in the wrong box. It was in the Dwight Schrute <laughs> box <laughs> from the office. They had the the plastic and, and somebody said it could be real, it could be fake. We never know. But I wouldn't I've seen it. I've seen it plenty of times that Funko does do silly things like that. So let's go to the next one. Okay, so okay, this is a new looking protector or oh, protector uh box one. order. This has two pops in it. So let's uh to crack that open. Oh, oh, I think we got some anime ones right here. Hold up. Yep. Ooh. We have the Compress and Kag Kaguya Pop, Naruto and My Hero. Those is yours. You can go ahead and show them up. Let the people know how you feel about them. I think oh, look the, at these bad babies. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think we're going to be hitting uh, the uh, Danny Phantom. Oh, we're gonna hit last. Them. I these, think that's going to be the last one. Yeah, these are, both of them have con stickers on them. Yeah. Both have con stickers. Oh, yeah. Uh, anything from the lottery, you will have... The con sticker. You will have a con sticker. So there's that one. And then here is the Mr. Compress. Them con stickers is beautiful. I heard they're not anti-tamper with you. can't tamper yep. with them anymore. Uh, if you... Well, dang, I don't know. It doesn't look like it. These look pretty normal to me. They say like so, it's supposed to be glued on there now. You can so, like, see. You can't, you can't even take them off. It, you, like you can still see through the sticker kind of. So it doesn't. I did see one that looked like there was like a bubbled seal. I don't really see that too much on these pops. So uh, it may, may not be. You can go ahead and get that last one. Good old Danny Phantom right there. Look at that bad boy. Woo! And we got and the red goblin. Oh, yes. 
There you go, man. See, no one knows about this. This, this oh is, yeah, this is, oh yeah. This is a childhood right here. Put those over here. That's a childhood Put right that there. Right there. They couldn't eat more of those. So we got the Danny oh, Phantom God, and Red Goblin. Here's the back of the box on that. I like that most of these uh, ones from Con have a, a cool little art box, that. and uh, nothing is, else is going to be in the wave as of yet for Danny Phantom. Uh, so good chance that's probably the only pop of Danny Phantom. That and they might do a regular with him and like not as the, uh, in his ghost form, you know, with the black hair. So we have the Danny Phantom Red Goblin Kaguya, Mr. Compress, the Young Ben, Bloody, and then we got the Street Art Deluxe Pop Miles Morales. And a lot of people gave this one crap, but I think it looks a that lot. Actually looks nice. It looks really it dope looks in really person. Nice. It's and, very something that's yeah. very unique and different. Yeah. We've seen the same thing. And, to and me, that's really different. Yeah, and, and he, it makes sense for him because he can automatically camouflage himself and be see through. So I think it works for him. Some of the other Marvel characters, uh, I don't really get it. I don't really get. I'm I'm curious. Some of what they're saying to me. <laughs> yeah, I'm curious to see who else they're gonna do. I know they'll probably do an Iron Man and Thor yeah. and stuff. I could definitely and, and see I'll that. Probably like, um, yeah. So this is our our haul from the Funko Lottery. Let you guys know it is possible. Uh, I'm not nowhere near over. Well, I'm near a thousand, but I'm not like in the thousands and thousands subs and. He's not a big tuber IG or of any sort, so it is possible. Uh, we are not in Funko's back pocket, so nope. let us know if, how you guys feel about the haul. Everything came in really good. I've never seen those uh, two-pack sorters before. That's a first. That was yeah, really a first. they shipped it really well. I was a little worried uh, one of them might come in the wrong box, and I also worried that they were going to be damaged because of what I was seeing online. So none of those things happened. Everything came in pretty cool. We're going to slide these in some protectors. I'm going to hit y'all with some a uh, couple of reviews of some of these Spider-Man ones later on. You got anything to say before we head out? Mr. Lottery winner! Got nothing. So Marcus just got married not too long ago. <laughs> And Funko blessed him big time by get, yeah, get, right. getting blessed them. Me. Yeah, oh, this, it this me Funko right lottery. Day. So it blessed me not only the same day of closing on the house, same day, same day of closing on the house. I got that email while I was at work. I was like, "What is this?" I was like, "Nah." And a that's week, just and a week before that, you got married. Yep, week before that, I got married. So, so it was it was really really good. I saw like emails just like, "Nah, this is fake." And then I clicked on it and went straight to Funko. I was like, "Hey, you a winner?" I was like. Yeah, that's a oh, surreal moment. No need to get up early in the morning trying right. to chase after these pops. Or bro. online stuff, like trying to get that time. Because like I told people, a lot of stuff was going to be releasing early. And people didn't believe it. But hey, this is our big haul, you guys. Thank you so much for always stopping through. You already know what to do down there. Like and subscribe, if you will. I appreciate you all. Thank you, and please let me know in the comments what you got for New York Comic Con, and if you were lucky enough to be a Funko Lottery winner. Appreciate you guys. Take it easy.